हाई फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू विथ इच टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक फेजेस ऑफ बिजनेस साइकिल टिल नाउ वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ बिजनेस विच आर अवेलेबल एंड नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इन केस फॉर एग्जाम्पल आई हैव स्टार्टेड अ सोल ट्रेडिंग कंसर्न अदरवाइज आई हैव स्टार्टेड ए पार्टनरशिप कंसर्न आई हैव स्टार्टेड अ जॉइंट स्टॉक कंपनी so whatever business you start your business is going to have different levels of success maybe uh, how is my business at the initial stage of uh, entrance how is it you know after one year how it is after two years so what are different phases of any business and you can see generally there are five different stages of business you can note down depression stage recovery stage prosperity stage boom stage and recession stage there are five stages of every for every either successful failure whatever it is every business person has to go through these five stages in his lifetime and uh, fa- slowly we shall discuss about how does a stage of depression be uh, how is your business in a stage of recovery and so far and if you can see in a depression stage the name itself is talking about generally it is a prolonged period where your business is slowly coming into existence you are very normal you are at a very peak st- you are at a very low stage you are trying to see that you have started a business this is the first stage of business cycle so introduction stage you will have Uh, so many problems to enter into the market people should accept your product you should be known to people it will take some time you cannot just run and good get profits as and when you have started your business so how are the features going to be is first one is you will have sharp reduction your production quite simple when you are coming for the first time you have to take into account how is my demand going to be slowly you will come with your production the second one is you will have large scale unemployment you don't know how much production you have to take care how many people are required because as you are coming fresh into the market you have to slowly learn each and every point and you don't know how you have to pay wages to the people low wages contraction of credit you ca- as you are coming new into the market you don't know people around you and people don't know you so what happens is getting funds from outside credit from outside becomes problem when you are coming new into the market and the other one is you have a chance of business failures so initial stage of starting you should be prepared you should be ready so that even do i have losses in the first 2 3 years i have to be strong and see the time coping up with the business and the other one is you will have an atmosphere of pessimism that is you will have negatives you will have uh, problems in introduction stage you will not have funds you will not have production done though you have done your production that will not be sold out so easily so it is a stage of mixed feelings of introduction where you have to be very strong wait positive and see that you will move on to the next stage called recovery stage and you can see uh, during the stage recovery is the second stage in your uh, a stage of business cycles where slowly we are trying to come out of the losses we are slowly nowadays people are trying to recognize you you are slowly getting accustomed to the customers who are there in the at market and you can see in this stage you will have slight improvement in the economic activity slowly people started recognizing your business people started knowing about you they are at least thinking of to purchase your products at least once slowly you are recovering from the stage of depression and you can see the volume of production slowly increases i don't say you will have good profits but slowly you will try to increase your production prices slowly try to rise because people are knowing you wages also generally when you are known to people you will have good amount of sales at least so you should produce more so you require people so you have to pay good amount of wages and whenever there is an increase in price profits also will increase and slowly people will try to recognize and outside people financial institutions also try to concentrate on you try to at least think of you when you go for credit 
so in the initial stage people don't know about you people will not give you credit but in the stage of recovery slowly you are being known to the society whereas prosperity is a third stage where this is the stage where you will have a slow run in your business it is not working but a slow run in your business where your production is going to increase right heavy capital investment you are going to get funds from outside and invest in your business expansion of bank credits you are able to go approach a bank tell about your business and get loans from banks also high prices followed by high profits large amount of your business is slowly expanding you are trying to go with new business ideas also you are able to provide complete employment full employment for your people and generally this is a stage of optimism that is you are thinking in a positive sign everything is coming slowly you are going into a stage of prosperity in the first stage of depression you are in a pessimistic mood and in the third stage of your cycle you have come into a positive mood that is optimistic mood the fourth one is the boom stage that every businessman has to go through this stage where you will have complete control of the market you will be in a stage of high prices high profits full employment right in the fourth stage of your business cycles it is called boom stage where every business person has to go pass through this stage in his lifetime this is a stage where you will have excess profits excess prices full employment complete prosperity you are going to rule the market in this stage so here you will have prosperity conditions for your business you have flow of investment beyond your expected levels so people are ready to invest on your company people are waiting for you because you have been in a stage of boom and even you have crossed the feeling of optimism you are standing at the peak where you are ready to uh, you are becoming monopoly slowly in the market you are experiencing the topmost priority position in the society and the last stage is called recession stage where generally this is a stage where slowly we will try to will have a feeling of fear and hesitation about if at all you reach a position of peak stage so what should be my next stage will be a dilemma stage and that is called recession where every company every businessman has to forego has to follow have to go through this stage also and in this stage you can see every sorry every large and successful business every business has to once or any time in the life you have to go through this uh, caution bell it is just a caution bell where your sales or production will slowly come down so you are slowly coming out of your market and this is a stage where you have to concentrate more on your production you should see why my sales are coming down why am i into the stage of recession and see that if you cope up with the stage you will again go back to a stage called prosperity if at all there is a good new competitor in your market giving good products than your products so it is a caution for you it is a bell for you to take care of your business and see that from recession you are again going back to recovery stage or prosperity stage where you can compete again with the competitor so these are all the five different stages that every business person once in a lifetime has to pass through this stages right and this is all about different simple topic but quite very important topic where different stages of your business cycle are gone through thank you